everyone, I'm Connie Roberts. And I'm George Roberts. Welcome to the Pocono Mountains Today TV show. It's the month of October and there's lots of beautiful leaves changing colors. That's right, Connie, lots to see and do. Let's take a look. Joining me now on the program is Chris Barrett with the Pocono Mountains Visitors Bureau. Chris, great to have you on the program as always. Let's talk about fall foliage because it's a great time of year to be here in the Poconos. There's always something going on. Right, and you know, George, the best thing people ask all the time, what's the best way to enjoy the Poconos? I always encourage them to go on our website at PoconoMountains.com and check out the fall foliage forecast, which is updated every week, comes from DCNR. So it's incredibly accurate. You can plan around it nice. because the Poconos is pretty vast right. from the north to the south. So it's 2,400 square miles. And if you miss one part of the season, you can still catch foliage in the other, which is really cool. Different climates in the Poconos. So of course the leaves will change at different times, which is really interesting. So you're right. You can always check it out if you missed it. <laughs> right, so, right, so the north will change first and then it'll kind of slowly go through the central and then into the southern Poconos. And DCNR is predicting that we should have a pretty good canopy, is what they call it, for four to six weeks. Nice. So we had enough uh, wetness this summer with, and combined with enough heat. Last year wasn't as good. This year they're hoping for a nice vibrant look for fall foliage. Great. Every town in the Poconos has some sort of fall foliage event going on. So we encourage people to get out there and take advantage of it. Right. So fall, for instance, Jim Thorpe has a month and a half to two months of fall foliage events. Mm -hmm. So again, that's all on our website at PoconoMountains.com. A lot of our towns have that. So it's really great to visit a lot of our small towns just in general, but if you're going for a specific weekend or even during the week, you could pick up any event that's happening during fall. Right, we have a few trains up here in the Poconos that have excursions during the fall, which are really a great way to see the fall foliage. Right, speaking of Jim Thorpe, you know, if you're, if you're, if you're going to use the Lehigh Gorge uh, railway passenger line there, a trip through that is just gorgeous because it's a 25 mile back and forth to Whitehaven and uh, back and forth from Whitehaven and it's just, it's gorgeous right along the river. And of course the Sturbridge line up north, same thing. So that goes all the way through a wooded area and past the Lackawaxen River just really looks great in the fall. You know, and the best thing too is fall foliage is not a weekend, just a weekend thing. That's right. I mean, right? you can come any day of the week, which is really, really great. Um, but also too, your temperatures are more moderate. So if you're coming here, if you're not a real strong winter person or you're not a strong summer person as far as heating and cold, mm -hmm. you know, the temperature tends to be more moderate. So you could do so many things outside. You can hike, you can bike, you could still enjoy the rivers uh, because we had good water. So right. we're probably having still good rapids all the way throughout the fall season. So you can do almost anything outside that you wouldn't do in the summer or the winter and the temperature's more moderate. Right. If people want more information about the fall foliage, that forecast again for the fall leaves, they can all get all that information from your website. Right, so if they go to PoconoMountains.com or we do a lot of fall programming on PTN, the Pocono Television Network, at PoconoTelevision.com. Hi everyone, we're here at Kinsley ShopRite, located in Broadheadsville, and I'm Connie Roberts, joined by the one and only legendary Kevin Kern. And Kev, there's always something fun going on here at Kinsley ShopRite. Let's tell everybody about it. This time of year, what happens is a lot of folks will be enjoying the Order Express app so that they can order all their food fare for their watch parties. So what I did was I took the leisure of putting together four of the most popular. We got some sausage and pepper sandwiches right here. We have the meatballs. We got these barbecue ribs. Everybody loves these ribs. This is a real good seller. And of course, I got the wings plain because it's my preference. Now I'm going to go ahead and serve up some meatball sandwiches to Connie and Catriano over here. See how that meatball fits right in there? Mmm. Those are my favorite. The meatballs Mito. are my favorite. These are my favorite. <laughs> so now we have some new items on the table, Kev. Let's talk about them because they look good. <laughs> okay, well, in October, of course, everybody loves pumpkins and all the pumpkin spice and caramel apples and things like that. So if you're going to a party, really, it's so easy to stop by Kinsley Shop right at Broadsville and pick up a nice platter. If you want to go and you have a message like go your, your team or something, we could go decorate. Eagles. Yeah, we could decorate a <laughs> cookie with whatever you want and then you put it out and, and that's fun. people. Now here we have these pumpkin rolls. 
Okay. These are available over in the uh, bakery department in the freezer, so you take them out, you let them go. I'm gonna cut one of these up so you can see what's inside of it. If you're gonna use pumpkin rolls or something similar to this, it's always better to have it cold. Not so much frozen, but really cold, so you can go ahead and make really nice cuts just like this. And look, you can handle it pretty well, too. Kev, they took our picture and put it on a cake. They put it on a cake. Not only did <laughs> they put it on a cake, but we actually told them what we wanted in the cake. All right, so I believe we have a custard, strawberry filling, vanilla cake right here with an image of us on that cake. Now, if you have your son, your daughter, your pet, your grandmother, your grandfather, <laughs> heck, maybe some of your best friends in a memorable moment. So you can't just bring a digital file, it has to be printed. Yeah, you wanna bring us a, a photograph, a printed photograph. That's what we copy, we scan that ourselves then we can put that image on your cake that you designed. And there'll be no alterations, just the nope, just way it is. The way it is, you give it to us, and then we go ahead and put it on there. Joining me now is Kayla Kinsley, and you're in charge of the entertainment here. Let's tell everybody what's happening for the Spooktacular event. Okay, so the Spooktacular event is an annual event that we do here at the store. Uh, it's a great way for families to come out with their kids. So fun, yet safe, enjoyable. Halloween festivity for everybody. So let's tell everyone what's going to be here the day of the event and what's happening. So there'll be a, a costume contest, there'll be goodie bags, there'll be face painting, there'll be pony rides, uh, arts and crafts, and Gary in the Morning will be here to play some Halloween music. So it's a free event. Um, I would just say come prepared for the weather. It's October 29th from 3 p.m. to 6 p.m. So Kayla, this is part of the goodie bag? Yes. So it is a cupcake decorating kit that every kid is going to get when they come here. <laughs> so, so let's have some fun and decorate then. Yes. <laughs> Who doesn't love a good cupcake? And there'll be chocolate and vanilla in here as well. So, so you have choices. Have, yeah, the best of both worlds. Nice. So everybody gets a kit? Yes. So every kid that comes and gets a goodie bag is going to get a kit. Nice. I'm not that crafty, oh. but yeah, it was fun. Yeah. <laughs> Joining me now is Lynn from the pharmacy, and I hear you have flu shots available. Yep, flu shot season is here again. Here at Kinsley Shop right at Broadsville, we are proud to serve the community again this year with lots of different vaccines available. Uh, we're doing the flu shot by walk-in, um, and we do have the senior high-dose flu shot, so we do have both vaccines available. Uh, we're super proud to announce that we just received the Moderna spike vac vaccine, um, so we do have the new COVID Moderna booster. Uh, we are doing those by appointment only. So we're doing the Get Your Two Shot campaign. So here at ShopRite, uh, we do have some other vaccines available. We are still doing the shingles vaccine, uh, still offering the tetanus vaccines, uh, the Boostrix, and we are just got the RSV vaccine also. So if you provide us with a prescription from your doctor for the new RSV vaccine, uh, we'd be able to provide that also. All right, sounds good. You can all get your shots right here. So Kevin, if people want more information, what should we tell them? Well, you can stop on down here at the world's largest shop right, Kinsley Shop right at Broadsville, or you can call me at 570-402-2740 to place your catering order, whether it be small or large. Joining me now on the program is Tom Yannick with Yannick Funeral and Cremation Services here in Mount Pocono. Tom, great to have you on the program. Oh, thanks, George. Thanks for having me today. You know, as always, people are procrastinators and they wait till the last minute to do things, especially with funerals. And uh, I know it's a good idea to really work on a pre-arrangement for funeral services. Why is that? Uh, George, it's a good idea to get that information down on paper. Sometimes folks like to go ahead and set aside the cost for, for funeral services and cremation services. Um, it's just a, less of a situation when someone does pass away. It's much easier for their family to get through that process. Okay. Some people have questions about whether it's a good idea to even have a funeral service. But as you've told me before, it's something that every person really needs. Correct. It's a part of the closure. People seem to, to really do better when they have that time for folks to come pay their condolences. And this day and age, they're doing it in all different kinds of ways. Um, we see things at fire halls, churches, a lot of times the funeral home isn't even involved, but it's still a good idea to memorialize that person. People that are watching and are not familiar with Yannick Funeral and Cremation Services, tell us about what you offer here. So here at our funeral home, we offer cremation, which is di sometimes direct cremation, uh, cremation with a memorial service. 
uh, cremations with a viewing and a full funeral service, as well as traditional funerals. Uh, we also guide families when it comes to having off-site services, whether it's something at a local church or at a different venue like a restaurant, we could certainly assist you with that process as well. Um, once we're done here at the funeral home, we could provide you with the necessary stationery that you need. We could provide you with obituary information. We also work on death certificates, things like that, to make sure that everything is done just the way it should be for your loved one. For folks that want to have burial after cremation, uh, you can in fact bury those cremated remains. And a lot of times they're familiar with the cemetery and it still is the process and we still bury those remains in a cemetery. And you're a locally owned uh, facility here. Correct. We are the only locally owned facility here on the mountain. We've been here since 2015. Um, as you know, I'm also the Monroe County Coroner, so we've been around for quite a while now. And joining us now as a guest here at the funeral home is Michael Mancuso. He's the first assistant district attorney here at Monroe County and also a local attorney here in town. Michael, a lot of times people get themselves in trouble because they aren't organized before their death with their important papers and wills and things like that. It's important, isn't it? Oh, absolutely, George. And the word organized was one of the catchwords in my mind. Um, you have to have your personal effects organized. So you should collect them all. You should put them in a central location, um, preferably a lockbox, something that may be fireproof. It doesn't have to be locked itself, but it should contain your um, up-to-date last will and testament, um, any power of attorney you might have, uh, stock certificates, IRAs, life insurance, all that kind of stuff. A, a nice list of your next of kin and contact information for them. So that's organization um, is one key phrase to keep in mind for this purpose. The other is make it accessible. Um, and you do that by keeping it together, yes, in a location where people can access it, but giving notice to people that you trust that that's where your documents will be. You mentioned wills. Uh, some people may not think it, they're important, but uh, they are. If you have um, assets that are going to pass through an estate, um, you have to have a will. If you're ill, you're not feeling well, um, maybe you, you have a bad diagnosis, something like that, and you want to make changes to your will, I urge you to get an attorney uh, to do that for you because uh, the fact that your will will be uh, written, they call it scrivened, by an attorney uh, gives it a higher status and it's very, very difficult to challenge the validity of a will like that as opposed to uh, handwriting something yourself, maybe asking a friend or two to come witness it. Michael, thank you very much. Appreciate Thanks, it. Thanks, George. If people want more information about your services, how do they get it? They can certainly go to www.yannickfuneralhome.com or they can always give us a call at 570-839-8900. Coming up next, fall's a great time to get a new shed or garage to store things for the winter. Plus, a real estate company celebrates 35 years. Community, it's where we work. It's where we play. It's where you'll find First Northern Bank and Trust, offering community banking services. First Northern Bank and Trust is a family owned and operated bank. Our local decision makers offer fast approvals and customized financial solutions. Plus, we keep your money right here in the community, stimulating local economic growth and providing jobs for our friends and neighbors. First Northern Bank and Trust, member FDIC, equal housing lender. The heat got you beat? Don't sweat it. KMB Plumbing, Electrical, and HVAC offers air conditioning to fit any needs, including ductless. Call 570-460-0111. What keeps you cool but doesn't use ducts or windows? A ductless air conditioning system. Easy to install and zones for every room. Call KMB Plumbing, Electrical, and HVAC. 570-460-0111 to learn more. Joining me now is Joe. We're here at Kramer Sheds in Tannersville. And Joe, it's the fall. People are starting to think about, you know, putting things away. And I know you got some specials on sheds and garages and things like that. Let's talk about that. All sheds that are in stock are now 10% off. All swing sets that are in stock are now 20% off. In stock vinyl furniture is 15% off. All in stock garages are 10% off. And anything that we have in stock, we could have to you within a few days of you coming in, placing the order, we can have it on your property. It's a great idea right now to come on out and see what you have on site, you know, and save some money and have things ready, you know, for the winter and then again for the spring and everything. Absolutely, you could get your deck cleaned off, you could get your patio furniture away, you can have use of your garage, 
for the winter by getting all the stuff out of your garage and into your shed. I see you have some new things here, new designs. What is this right here? So home offices have become a little bit more popular now. Um, so this is just a design that we came up with where we have a little bit of a porch. You have the interior seating area so you can you know, meet people outside. You still can meet them inside the office. It gives you a, a nice idea to put something on your property and uh, be able to work out of it there. And you have things like one car garage, two car garages. I see you have a nice design here on site. Yep, our garages, and especially now, a lot and a lot of homes were built with garages on them. We have an option to bring in a prefabricated garage. Gives you instantaneous use of it. You can park your car. You can get your car out of your driveway for the winter not have to clean it off in the snow. It'll give you room for those ATVs or UTVs or snowmobiles, whatever you want to put away that you want, don't want to get beaten up by the elements. Yeah, that's a great idea. Construction on these, really nice and really good construction. Let's talk about how they're made. We put great construction on, on all our products and which is why we back everything with a 10 year warranty. It's all two by four construction. It's all 16 inches on center. All our garage floors are pressure treated. Um, it's designed to, to hold up and last you a long time and you know, you're know you warrantied for 10 years. So if anything does happen, we'll come out, we'll fix it and we'll take care of it. You know, a nice backyard element too to have in your landscape is a gazebo. Absolutely, gazebos are very popular. We actually uh, just started doing uh, prefabricated pavilions as well. So we can bring in, if you don't want the traditional gazebo where it has the rails around it, a pavilion gives you a little bit more of an open field. It comes with the floor. We can uh, then just deliver it in one piece. We also have them where we can build them on your deck or patio without the floor where your patio and deck would be the floor for it. Okay, I also understand that you have financing. Let's talk about that. Uh, we have uh, finance. We have our, our Wells Fargo, which offers uh, six months no interest. We also have our, our rent to own, which our rent to own is a great opportunity for you to make low monthly payments towards that garage, shed, gazebo, playset. Whatever you, you've been wanting for, but maybe just don't have all the money up front, it gives you an opportunity to break it down into low monthly payments, and you can pay it off at any time. Sounds good. If people want more information about Kramer Sheds, how do they get it? Best way is to go on our website, which is www.kramersheds.com, or you can call us here. We're, all, we're here in Tannersville seven days a week at 570-629-7099. Hi everyone, I'm Connie Roberts and I'm joined with Tom and Christine Wilkins and we're here at Wilkins and Associates. Tom, there's a lot of history, celebration going on here. Let's yes. tell everyone about it. Uh, we're celebrating our 35th uh, anniversary of being in business. We started in Mount Pocono with three people and then brought our corporate office down to Stroudsburg years ago, uh, to tell you the truth. And then 15 years, we're also celebrating a second anniversary and that's with Better Home and Gardens Real Estate, Wilkins and Associates. And we were the first real estate company to join Better Home and Gardens Real Estate. Wow, that, that helped change with the technology. Oh, without a doubt, the, the real estate market, the Pocono real estate market and the real estate market in general, uh, technology has just taken over the entire business like that. Everything is done online at this particular junction from your listing agreements to the agreements of sale and such. We got rid of all the filing cabinets. Everything is available via our cell phone. And the only thing different with that change is agents don't come into the office as much because they have that technology available to them wherever they are. So we literally went from 14 offices down to one because all the agents can do all their business on the phone when we have our sales meetings. Uh, some are with us on Zoom, others are with us in person, so it did change the Pocono real estate market. So you have a lot of businesses under one umbrella. Let me preface that by saying we love what we do and we do what we love. So we do have other businesses. We have NEPA Management Associates where we handle a lot of uh, the associations in the Poconos, uh, Carbon County, Lehigh County, Pike County and such as well as long-term rentals, which is what we call mm -hmm. them, where we manage those and then rent them out through Better Home and Gardens Real Estate and manage them through NEPA management. Christina, I understand the rental market is changing here in the Poconos. Can you explain that a little bit more? Yes, especially the rental market has gone through a lot of changes in the last few years. You know, during the pandemic when people 
were making emotional moves. Um, a lot of people from the cities moved to our area, um, which took up a lot of our long-term rentals. And then other uh, people saw opportunities in investing into short-term rentals and the Airbnb market. Well, now that the pandemic is behind us and people are getting back to their normal course of business, um, we're starting to see a lot of those Airbnb homes make their natural progress of coming back on the market first as a long-term rental uh, because the Airbnb market is looking for uh, stable income. They don't have to pay the electric, the cable, the phone as they would as an Airbnb. So they're finding um, a better investment that way. And many of them have started putting their homes back on the market for sale as they get back to the regular life in the city areas. Christine, I know you're involved with local government as well. Uh, yes, I currently serve as chairwoman of the board for Stroud Township. I started off there uh, serving the zoning hearing board, also the planning commission, and then I was appointed, then elected uh, to the board of supervisors. And I really enjoyed that because I've really found that between local government and being in real estate serve hand in hand because they serve with your land uses, um, how property is being developed, your open space. And we have a pulse on what's happening in the real estate market to bring back to local government to say, hey, this is what you can kind of forecast coming through in the future. If people want more information of all the things that you do, <laughs> what should we tell them? You can reach us at 570-421-8950. And you can view us online at bhgwilkins.com. A local family business celebrating 35 years serving the entire Poconos. Call today. Join me now on the program is John Tuey. We're here with RJ Groner. Great to have you on the program as always, John, as we talk about heating, cooling, and plumbing. Emergencies happen in the Poconos. You can't get around it. And I know you guys are always ready for it. One of the big things that we get asked all the time, what happens when I have an emergency? Who do I call? If it's something with your plumbing, with your heating, with your air conditioning, who can you rely on after hours, not during normal business hours, but who's gonna come to you at night and on weekends? Well, I got an answer for you, George. It's actually us. Heating problems can happen any time of day or night, and sometimes cooling problems too. And you guys are ready for that. That's correct, George. As you can see from behind me here, we roll out in fully stocked trucks. Set up basically to handle about 90% of the emergencies that come across the board, uh, you know, at night and on weekends and when it's just off times like that. Maintenance goes a long way though, John, to keep from having an emergency. The whole design of maintenance is preventative. It's to stop those emergency problems from happening. 80% of the emergencies that we run to are usually related to lack of maintenance. Let's talk about water and well pumps. Here in the Poconos, a lot of homes have wells and pumps can fail. Mm -hmm. So George, one of the biggest surprises a lot of new homeowners get when they move to the Poconos, they come from maybe a city background where the water is supplied or more of a suburban area. Then they find out all of a sudden they're their own water source. And well pumps don't last, George. Average life expectancy, somewhere around five to 10 years, depending on conditions, depending on the weather, lightning strikes, there are many things that can happen to put that well pump out. One of the good things for those people, give us a call when you got a problem. Fully stocked, ready to get that pump replaced, get your water back up and running. John, let's talk about the 24 seven emergency service. You have a live person that actually answers the phone. Absolutely, George. One of the most important things you need when you have an emergency is somebody who's on the other side of the line who can empathize and understand what's going on. We found for our customers in the Poconos, having that live person 24 seven gives them that peace of mind and potentially walks them through something they can do immediately before anybody gets there to mitigate the problem. And let's talk about the technicians that you send out to solve these problems. They're certified and they're also people that live here. We spend a lot on our technicians for training and certifications. We want the best. We have the best and we want our customers to experience the best. All of our technicians live in the communities they serve. They're your friends, your neighbors. They're people that you know, you see the trucks drive by all the time. They're gonna be there to help you and they're gonna understand and they're gonna empathize with you about your problem to get it resolved and get it resolved quickly. People have an emergency or they just want to find out more about RJ Groner. How do they do that? Many different ways, George. Find us on Facebook. Find us at RJ Groner on the website. That's RJ Groner, G R O N E R.com. Give us a call, 570 421 7260. Text us, email us. Many ways to get in touch with us. Right through our website, live person on the other side to answer on the website. When you have an emergency, someone's going to be there to answer it for you, and somebody's going to be out there to take care of it for you. Still ahead, 
Chef Nicola shows how he prepares a tomahawk steak. The heat got you beat? Don't sweat it. KMB Plumbing, Electrical, and HVAC offers air conditioning to fit any needs, including ductless. Call 570-460-0111. What keeps you cool but doesn't use ducts or windows? A ductless air conditioning system. Easy to install and zones for every room. Call KMB Plumbing, Electrical, and HVAC. 570-460-0111 to learn more. First Northern Bank and Trust is your local loan specialist for both personal and business needs. Our local decision makers offer fast approvals and customized financial solutions, helping you reach your goals. First Northern Bank and Trust combines friendly service with the latest technologies to make banking quick, easy, and convenient. We continue to grow in Carbon, Lehigh, Monroe, and Northampton counties. Serving you with 11 local branches, First Northern Bank and Trust, member FDIC, equal housing lender. You know, the fall is coming shortly. We are in a, next to the fall door. Today I'm gonna show this marinated beautiful steak that um, have a big bone. It's, you know, tomahawk bone, beautiful Angus, marinated. We marinated over here, herbs, vegetable oil, a little bit crushed garlic, and Himalayan salt, big rack Himalayan salt inside. So I just take the steak, salt, pepper from both sides, and we put also, you know, in a pan, uh, just a touch of blended oil, vegetable oil, just a touch. We take the steak and put them right there. We're taking a couple cloves of garlic and we crush them. And I just put them in. We take the steak now, we're going to put them in a convection oven. We take the steak and we cut it this way. Beautiful. Don't forget, people, to eat this part. It's the best parts, these two sides. And you cut the steak. And you put the steaks, the steak. Wonderful. Ask mementos for any type of caterings that you have. In our best, we are not the best. In our best possibilities, we will try to do the best we can. Welcome to Momentos, and thank you. Well, George, that wraps up another great show. Sure does, Connie. Don't forget, if you want to see these videos again, just go to georgetv.com. Whatever you do, get out and enjoy the Pocono Mountains today.